Okay, we're here, and we're going to change our daughter Judith's undershirt. Uh, she currently has the Metacast that they put on for infantile scoliosis. And when they first did it for Judith, <laughs> she, uh, she had gotten her cast, and it was really scary because it was the first time we had ever experienced anything like this. And the people at the children's hospital... Were super awesome, really, really awesome people. But they had informed us that there were a lot of YouTube videos on how to change the shirts from underneath the cast. Um, unfortunately, when we went there, there was maybe one video that we could find that was semi helpful, and we had to just do it on our own. So, right now, what we're going to do is record a video of Judith getting her Metacast. Uh, shirt underneath undershirt changed out oh, it's also really important not to try and do this within like the first couple weeks at least yeah because of the padding and, and baby squishies and stuff it'll be way too tight you'd probably get the shirt off but you'll probably never get it back on judith has had this cast on for pretty much two months right now this is, this is probably the fourth maybe fifth shirt change we've done on her um, we didn't change the first one for maybe oh, close to a month because yeah. all the padding underneath, <laughs> she is. Oh, there, there you go, monkey. All the padding <laughs> underneath was very, very tight on her. Um, it wasn't so tight that it was constricting. It was just very tight to get fingers or anything under. Um, so sliding a new shirt in and out was going to be near impossible. So... Uh -huh. My wife removed her t-shirt. That's her dirty little shirt. Her little stinky shirt. Um, we just been doing our best to keep her... Oh, thank you. Keep her... Uh, yeah. Um, we've been doing our best to keep her as clean as possible. Uh, you know, not getting sweaty, not getting wet as much as possible just because the... Uh, the whole cast getting damp and we'll getting sores on, okay? and things like that. So far, she's done absolutely see. amazing. Let me see you. And she's just been a little trooper. It was one of the scariest things when we got it, but she's been doing a really good job. Okay, let's see your shirt on. No, you gotta come see me. You can see mom. Come see me real quick. No. no. Up, 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 up. Come here. Let's go. Okay, ready? So this is how we get it. Basically, exact reversal of putting the shirt on. It's pretty much like doing a baby shirt and put it over <laughs> over the head and then just kind of tuck it down, but it's just a lot more complicated. Yeah. <laughs> they told, Here, they turn her sideways, honey. I can't see what you're doing on that side. They told us at the hospital it would be like taking your bra off under your shirt. That is a lie. So she's pulling the cast underneath the shoulder part and uh, getting it in her, under the shoulder there. You okay, monkey? Okay. And then here's the other shoulder. See, it's kind of bunched up. And just find the bottom of the shirt and tuck it through the other thing. The other thing with these shirts is if you pull on them way too hard, they stretch super easy. There we go. So this is probably the hardest part, I would assume. I don't know. What do you think, Mom? It's the hardest part getting through the arms. It's terrible. It's step by step process. Can you see you? So now she's here. You're burping. Burping from dinner. So. Let's do the sides, and then from here, we just kind of snake it down. Hello. <laughs> Honey. <laughs> Honey, I can't see anything. There you go. So she just kind of snakes some of it through there. Tries to keep the neck even. Okay. 
And then see Judith. Some of the babies in the pictures we've seen had really big open spots in the back. If you can tuck your we weren't. Down and then just... oh. Yeah, we weren't as lucky to get a huge, huge uh, deal on there as far as the opening. But Judith had a about a forty-five by the time they got her in there to do the meta casting. The day they put it on, they x-rayed her, and she had a 45 all together with the bends. Okay. Right. And the first okay. cast, after they put it on, they x-rayed her, and it was all the way down to a 18. So it was a huge jump. Um, and this is the first cast she's had, mm-hmm. and uh, we're getting ready to remove it here very soon. At the children's hospital and get the uh, next one or maybe a brace. But because we haven't seen any videos online at all, we have decided to try and help some other parents so they don't feel like we did the first day we got home. Okay. And this is the part. I'm probably going to cut out here in a second. Because once you get down to the bottom, it's easier to lay her down. (sighs) Lay her down and tuck this under the first part and pull the shirt out and then just work it all the way around. But I have to take her diaper off, so that's pretty much it. That's the hardest parts of it already. You think you can? No. Okay. Yep. Oh, there you go. See how she got that under? That's pretty much what you do from there. Just get it to snake around without pulling too much of the shirt underneath, just a little bit. It's, you know, if you might have to roll it up or whatever, a ways. All right, let's roll back this way. Well, you didn't even have to take the diaper off. Yeah, all right, good. Yeah, Mom. Let's pull Mom. It. Oops. Mom. And it's going to pull it down snug, I would say, try and get all the wrinkles out as much as you can. Over wear and tear, it's going to slide back up and it's going to go back underneath and wrinkle and all that stuff. But as long as you get it down... Nicely even. I don't feel any wrinkles in the back area. So nice and soft and clean again for like five minutes. Yeah. So, that's pretty much it. Normally we don't pull this much of the shirt up. The material is usually half of that, about yeah. where it is right here would be the top. But uh, leaving the diaper on and pulling it through, we kind of got a little bit more shirt out. But she's also going to be getting this whole cast off and stuff to uh, tomorrow morning. So, it's super scary at first, but it gets easier with time. My wife's been a trooper and taking care of most of it because I have giant monster hands. <laughs> and these casts are pretty tight and it's really hard to uh, get big fingers and hands underneath these casts. So, there we go. There you go. Oh, nice. Oh, get great. Your yeah, get your finger That's out of cute. your nose. That's nice. Quit that. Quit that, stinky. Yeah. So there's there she is. Can you say bye bye? Say bye bye. Say bye bye. See you later. Maybe, maybe not. But yeah, <sighs> so that's Judith. She is a year and seven months. Jeez. Yeah. Huh? Year and eight now. Yeah, almost. Here in a week and a half, two weeks, year and eight months. So that's that's how you do it. We'll uh do a little video on how to do some pedals here pretty soon too just to help anybody that's really worried or confused about it it's not that bad <laughs> okay.